what happens when you talk to landowners? Uh, they 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 know the state line comes through there somewhere, mm -hmm. but you know, and, and they grow up on this property, and oftentimes they don't have surveys recent recent surveys, and so uh, they know the state line is the is on the edge of their property, but they don't know quite what it is, and then you can tell them, you know, you know that 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 mound of earth that you've got on that back side, well, that's where the state boundary is. And we're not setting new monuments. Basically what we're doing is we're taking a pile of earth that is the monument uh, and we're putting some more permanent uh, identifier to it so that it makes sense to the people that, that uh, it makes sense to the surveyors that survey the property, but it also makes sense to the, the homeowners that that mound is something special. It's so uh, awesome after a two mile hike into the woods looking for this particular lat long location and you walk up on it and I've heard stories of people that we've uh, had work with us in a workshop where they come to our location after a two mile hike and they look around and one of the guys was basically kicking on a what's called a, a pine knot which is an old surveyor's mark that, that they typically put in you know back 50 years ago they put in the ground to mark their locations and he was standing on the mound.